The day before the trial was set to start, Johnson & Johnson has agreed to pay $9.9 .9 million to settle a lawsuit. It was brought by Washington State, accusing it of misrepresenting the risks to pelvic mesh implants. Attorney General Bob Ferguson sued the New Jersey-based health care giant in 2016, claiming they failed to warn patients and doctors about the risks of dire, sometimes irreversible complications. He says the money will be used to help Washington women who had mesh implants. Johnson & Johnson did not admit any wrongdoing. I'm Ken Molestina for CBS Philly.